My guest today say one little lie can turn into a big problem. Please meet Rodney. He says he's excited to meet his new love face to face. Rodney, what's going on? Hey, Jerry, how you been today? Good, good. I'm here to say I'm breaking up with my girlfriend because I fell in love with a chat line girl. I've been talking to her for a long time. Wait, I, you have you have a regular girlfriend? Yes, I do. How long you been with her? I've been with her for a year now. Okay, and you are on the show to leave her to be with someone you met on a chat line? Yes, I do. Have you ever personally met this person? Or? No, I have not. So it's just been over the phone? It's just been over the phone. <laughs> well, how do you know what she's really like? She told me over the phone what she looks like. Oh. <laughs> and you're ready to give up your girlfriend? Yes. Well, if she's your girlfriend, I assume at some point you really cared about her. Yes, at the beginning I did, and then I actually... And what happened? How'd you meet her? Well, I was at a library one day, and yeah. I sat right no, there... No, seriously. Yeah, oh, seriously. okay, you were, okay. you were at a library. I was yeah. at the library, my own business on the corner, and it was her over on the other side, talking to a bunch of guys. She walked over and pronounced herself to me, Hey, I'm Lydia. And I said, Hey, how you doing? She said, Come on over here, talk to us, be sociable. And yeah. then from there, I started talking to her. And then that's ever since, and then uh, I went home. The next day, I found out she went to jail. She, why, for stealing, for she stealing library fight. books? She got in a fight with some girl. Oh. And called her mom. She said she's in jail. And I went down there to visit her. She had three days left. And I talked to her. I said, look, I know you ain't got nowhere to go. Why don't you come and stay and live with me, and we'll try a relationship. Well, that's a that's awfully nice. From from the library to jail, you're following her. Okay. And now, so she said yes? She said yes. And so you went to pick her up from jail? Yeah. Well, actually, she hopped on the city bus from the jail. I was downtown <laughs> waiting. Yeah. So I brought her some stuff. I had some flowers. I had a Pepsi and a carton amount of uh, Marlboros. Oh, well, good for you. So you, this, you're going all out here. You got the Pepsi. You got the... Marlboro's and you got the flowers. You got to charm your ladies. And she's getting off the bus. <laughs> and she's getting off the bus coming straight from jail. Yes. Good. Okay, now, and you take her home. And so that's the beginning. And, and at the, in the beginning, it was love? Yes. Well, what happened suddenly to make you want to leave her? Well, ever since she moved in, she turned medieval on my ass. <laughs> She probably ran out of smokes. <laughs> and, and so you've been fighting a lot? Yes, yes. Uh, she, uh, she got some mouth that never stops. She argues about, uh, I don't get to do the dishes and right there at that time when she wants me to do it, or yeah. she complains because of the cat's litter's not clean, or if she sees a cockroach, she got to complain about that. <laughs> she complains well, that I'm too, I spend too much on the PlayStation. First of all, if you don't want to be with Lydia, why don't you just tell her that? at the time, rather than, in a sense, cheating over the internet. You know, Jerry, how women don't listen to what people say? <laughs> I, I read that somewhere, but, uh, okay. So you're saying you told her you want out? Yes. Well, did you ask her to leave your home? Yes, I even called the call the law one day, and the law told her to leave. She don't want to leave. She stayed at the door, found him. Let me in. I'm going to be good. Oh, she, she come in. Yell so, me. all right. So you've kind of told her you're not interested in her anymore. Yes. So now you're on the chat line, and you've been talking to this woman on the chat line. Yes. And so you're here to meet her today. Yes. Oh, that's what we're doing. Oh, wow. Okay, but first we're oh, first we're going to meet your um, your girlfriend. Lydia's her name, right? Yes. And, uh, well, she's watching backstage, so she's heard you again say that you want her gone. Yes. Here is your girlfriend, Lydia. <laughs> Why are you going to leave me? Why are you going to leave me? Because you're too mean for me, and I'm a laid-back guy. I don't want no evil woman around me. You ain't dumping me. Well, you're going to be dumped. You got like messed up, big boy. Okay, work. now you know he's been talking to this woman on yeah, the chat line. I heard. And how long had this been going on? About six weeks. Six weeks. 
And so, and she tells you what she looks like. Yes. What does she look like? She says she has long blonde hair, yeah. blue eyes, and she's got an athletic build. <laughs> That's Rita. Here she is. What's her name? Candy. Here's Candy. Nice to meet you, Candy. Hi. Uh, is uh, long blonde hair. Is this her sister? Because she don't look exactly like she said on the phone. Look, I know I lied, but that's just what's on the script. I gave you, we went off script. I gave you my real phone number. We've been talking. I really care about you. We play the same, we play the same numbers in the lottery. We both like Chinese food. I really care Apparently. about you. Apparently. <laughs> No, I mean, you know, it's... Okay, so are you happy? Uh, no, I think I'll probably be better <laughs> off looking at the whip. We'll be back. If you think that was wild and crazy, then click here to keep watching. And don't forget to subscribe. All you have to do is click here. And one more thing. Take care of yourself and each other.